Hey guys, Luna here. So it's my first day in Shanghai. Last night I arrived around five o'clock. First I had a really hard time finding my Airbnb and then second was dealing with VPN issue because yes, Google, Facebook, Instagram, you name it, is blocked here in China. So today is my first day but um, pretty packed. My first interview is with Rochelle Jim, who's a designer based here in Shanghai. We're gonna go to table one and have some brunch. The place we wanted to go to, Table One, is closed and under renovation, so we're gonna try it somewhere else. <laughs> It's my second day here in Shanghai and I'm picking up a friend. We're headed to a friend of a friend's cupcake place. It's called Say Cupcakes. Loving Shanghai. I've only been here for a couple days and already I've done so much, met so many interesting people. It reminds me a little bit of New York. It has this work hard, play hard mentality and anything can happen in 24 hours.
Okay guys, so I'm in Kiboa, which is a water village here in Chiang Mai. Seems like everyone had the same idea and come uh, do some sightseeing since it's a holiday. And uh, it's a bit on the pack side. I decided to abort the mission. That was no joke in there. Pack like sardines. Times Square in comparison is a joke. Yeah. So I'm just gonna walk around in other areas and see what I find. No big deal. Tonight is Chinese New Year's and I'm already hearing the fireworks. Well, there you go, some fireworks. This morning I'm headed to NYU here in Shanghai to say hi to one of my old professors from grad school. So a little fact about me, I went to NYU grad school, this program called ITP, and NYU actually just opened up a school here in Shanghai. Headed to the airport on my way to Hong Kong.